Hello, this is Kevin Annett, Eagle Strong Voice. It's November the 1st, 2021. I've just received a very important breaking news announcement from the International Common Law Court of Justice. This is going out all over the world today. It's concerning an arrest warrant that's been issued against so-called Pope Francis, Jorge Bagoglio. And here's the press statement. Arrest order and warrant issued against Pope Francis by International Court. $10,000 reward and amnesty offered to detain Jorge Bagoglio for crimes against humanity. And this is coming from the Common Law Court of Justice headquarters in Brussels, New York, and Vancouver, Canada. The court that forced the resignation of Pope Benedict in 2013 has issued an arrest order and warrant against Pope Francis Jorge Bagoglio for crimes against humanity, along with a $10,000 reward for his capture. The International Common Law Court of Justice, the ICLCJ, issued the order and reward today along with an offer of amnesty from prosecution to any Catholic official or clergy who assists in the detaining and prosecution of Bergoglio. A copy of the order and warrant is being displayed all over the world. I'll show it to you in a minute. Now, according to the court statement that accompanied this order, quote, our prosecutor has in his possession documented evidence and eyewitness affidavits that attest to Jorge Bagoglio's personal complicity in child rape, torture and trafficking, ritual killing, medical genocide, obstruction of justice, and a general command responsibility for mass murder and other crimes committed by his Church of Rome. Bergoglio was subject to prosecution as an indictable individual under both common and international law, and he will be so prosecuted by our court. We are offering a reward and immunity for prosecution to anyone, and especially to any of Bergoglio's church associates, who assist us in detaining and prosecuting him. Now, this statement is especially important since Bergoglio has announced his intention to come to Canada and visit the mass grave site at the Kamloops Indian School run by his church, in which over half the children were killed, mass graves that are being systematically destroyed now to cover the fact that Bergoglio and others, including the Queen of England, were present there and were engaged in ritual sacrificial ceremonies involving children. From two eyewitnesses and other accounts, we have solid evidence of that. Now, to stop Bergoglio, it's up to each one of us to take this order seriously. Here is the arrest order and warrant. It went out today under the signature of Dominique Redvers Dufour, who is the secretary to the court. It says, arrest order, uh, order of arrest and warrant issued against Jorge Mario Bergoglio, a.k.a. Pope Francis. The aforenamed individual is accused by this court of complicity in capital crimes. He is hereby ordered to surrender himself to the sheriffs of the court or to responsible police officers deputized by the court for immediate arraignment on charges and specifications to be presented by the court's public prosecutor. Court sheriffs and the public are hereby authorized by this order and warrant to seek out, detain, and transport Bogolio to the court for his lawful prosecution. This order and warrant are issued today, the first day of November 2021, by the Criminal Trial Division of the International Common Law Court of Justice. Now, copies of this arrest warrant and this reward notice can be obtained by going to murderbydecree.com under ITCCS updates. That's the updates of the International Tribunal into Crimes of Church and State. Murderbydecree.com under ITCCS updates. By uh, tomorrow, the PDF will be posted there for you to run off and use. This empowers you to not only deputize the police to assist you, but to actually detain not only Bergoglio, wherever he goes in the world, but any of his associates, anyone aiding and abetting his ritual murderous crimes, especially against children. And here finally is the reward notice. Reward offering $10,000 not only to help detain and prosecute him, but any information leading to that. Now, the full background of this is obtained at murderbydecree.com. This is a call now for citizens everywhere in the world to take action. Detaining him and other Catholic officials will save the lives of children. There'll be more coming up. Follow us again, murderbydecree.com, and every Sunday, 6 p.m. Eastern at bbsradio.com slash who we stand. This is Kevin Anand, Eagle Strong Voice, in the capacity as Canadian Field Secretary of the International Common Law Court of Justice. I thank you. Stand by for more.